I am hoping that there'll be a lesson will have been learned that they can't leave the leave parts of the country behind, and that they'll actually invest in those areas and make so the country isn't isn't so so, so London centric anymore. I mean, do you trust them to do that given what's going on right now? Right now, I'm hoping we can use the threat that people that if, if something like if something if they don't make a change, this sort of thing will happen again and again. And you're going to see a rise of, of far right parties unless we make a change right now. But why, why just far right parties? Couldn't there be an opportunity for other people? The, well, other people other people might come in, but until we get rid of the first past the post, we're not going to get other smaller parties coming coming into the fray. We need to get rid of first past the post first. So who would you vote for if it was tomorrow? If I mean, general election tomorrow. Who would you vote for? General election tomorrow, I'd have to vote for a party that wants to stop this mess. Such as? It'd be um, Green. It'd pro probably be Green, to be honest. Yeah? Yeah. So I, I feel personally trust in politics right now is Caroline Lucas. Yeah? <laughs> Do you think the Greens have got a big enough platform though? They've been around for a long time. Don't you think people want something a bit different? I think the main thing that needs to happen is voter reform. That's the, that's the main... That's voter the main reform thing. first, new parties after this. Yeah, yeah. 